Now, the job of the police is to protect and to serve. And in the future, they're going to have some really cool gadgets to help them out. Today, we're looking at the future of law enforcement on The Future. Good morning. Yeah, right back at you, RoboCop. And you're not alone anymore. All over the country, police are getting futuristic. Granting us top secret access into their state-of-the-art facility are the people who invented the Taser, Taser International. You guys are really shifting the paradigm on law enforcement. What does the future of law enforcement look like, you think? Well, I think it involves tech because it's just rapidly growing at this exponential rate. And if you don't embrace tech, you're not evolving. Everyone knows it's for Taser. Lipstick Taser! From cartoons right. to lots of stories that are Don't out there. Don't tase me, bro. Oh, right? That whole a, thing. If I had a penny for every time I heard that. Yeah. When you deploy a consumer taser, it works for 30 seconds. Oh, wow. So you place it on the ground, you get the safety, you call 911, just trying to get you out of a dangerous situation and make you disappear. The second tool that we've created that's changing law enforcement now is putting on a body-worn camera so that you're recording what your interaction is with the public. And I think Ferguson truly opened up the minds of law enforcement to say, mm, hey, that could definitely. have been us. And we could have used technology to prevent something like that right. from happening. Former police officer of 26 years, Rick Gilbo, gives us his experience. People behave better when they know they're being recorded. Well, I remember one incident where we stopped a couple subjects. They ended up having warrants. We arrested them. They filed a, a citizen complaint against us for us being unnecessarily rough with them. And it took a long, intense investigation, had to collect witnesses because it was just our word against theirs. Uh, this could have solved that in a matter of minutes rather than a matter of months. The video that sets the truth free has to go somewhere. Turns out the cloud is part of law enforcement's future also. We use what's called evidence.com, and that's where all the data is put. It's not just the the video that's collected, it's anything that's digital. We have to keep the information secure. We have to keep it shareable instead of burning CDs and having a policeman deliver that. It's old fashioned. Definitely. So we do a lot more than just taser and cameras. Tomorrow's police officer tech today on 